Good evening, I'm Ann Nyberg. Darren has a night off. An effort to stop violence in cities across the nation by bringing the community closer to their police department. National Night Out was observed in several Connecticut cities this evening, including New Haven. News 8's Jamie Mural joins us live from the Elm City with more on the message that they hope will stop crime. Jamie? And good evening. It's a message that really is spread throughout this country. You know, when National Night Out started back in 1984, just about 2 million people participated, a good number, but now that number has grown to more than 37 million, as you mentioned, New Haven being one of those communities. In some areas, a night out can sometimes mean coming upon another crime scene, staring at a police force searching for another suspect after another act of violence. I'm behaving, I'm behaving. Juan Gutierrez's face shows he is worrying about none of that on this night. This night is a celebration of community, joy in the blanket of goodwill that can be found in the simplest of places, an asphalt parking lot. That's the main purpose, to keep the community together, and especially the young kids, young boys, young girls, that we have to keep them in this type of atmosphere. It's better, you know, for them. It's National Night Out, a 29-year-old countrywide program designed to bring people together to heighten crime prevention awareness by building anti-crime programs, all while enjoying the pleasure of a neighbor's company. The kind of night Juan used to see more of when he was a kid. It has changed quite a bit, and that's why I want to be part of this so that we can help this young generation go up and advise them that is a better life ahead for them. Childhood innocence changes as quickly as the seasons. Kids can go down a dark path, although many at this New Haven event feel even a simple cookout can reinforce family values. I think it brings everyone together for a common goal purpose, just to get together so we know, you know, our neighborhood. Cynics may say one national night out won't stop another crime scene, yet perhaps reaching just one person on the simplest joys of what community means lessens the number of times these people are needed. Yes, it is the best life, the best, and I invite people to enjoy it. 15,000 communities nationwide. Some other Connecticut communities include Rockville as well as Groton. However, we're live here in the Elm City. I'm Jamie Miro, Music.